Ice block is the newest ability that was recently given to the Ice Wizard. And the way it works is it freezes your Ice Wizard and whoever is on his right and left side for 2.5 seconds. Now why would you want to do that? Well, it's pretty simple. Maybe you want to abuse a certain pink haired child. The frozen minis will tank all the incoming damage in the entire duration of the 2.5 seconds which is a creative way for the developers to add a counter to clash abilities. I gotta say, I'm impressed by their creativity. You all got some of it? Creativity? I, ne I need some over here. So basically one, two, three or four clash abilities, it doesn't matter, they will all get soaked which works very well against those weirdos that spam royal champion clash. And it can completely deny a fisherman hook, which I thought was pretty cool. But aside from canceling clash abilities, there is a few great applications that many of you might have not thought of. Now for starters, it can for some reason stop the shield maiden's clash ability which doesn't even deal damage, and likewise it can completely cancel out the knight stunt, which can be pretty useful in some cases. I guess assuming the knight exists, who even uses the knight? Does any of you even remember that he's a thing? Another interesting use for it is against royal ghost. Some decks have this strategy of luring your ranged backline by hiding their tanks, which ultimately ends up in them being exposed to damage. Ice block can stop your backline for 2.5 seconds, which would almost entirely prevent that. It also tanks a monk hit. I. I, I'm aware this will never happen in real match. I think that's all the good uses for it. Well, maybe except for the monk one, it's kind of useless. It's still cool to know though. Which might sound a bit niche, but hey, anything other than countering clash is just an extra as it's mainly an anti-clash ability. But what about the bad uses for it? I mean, certainly there's like wrong ways of using it. Well, starting off by the heroes, Ice Block can completely waste the Royal Champion and the Shield Maiden's clash ability. But the Monk and the Wave Master are fast enough to still get their clash. Wave Master though is like a bit of a weird case because if you freeze the troop below him, it doesn't work. I would have expected him to at least defreeze them. I'm disappointed in you, Mr. Wave Master. For minis, we have a lot to go through. Like Taunt on Knight and the Roar on Barbarian both get wasted. Miner and Spear Goblin also both lose their clash ability. Lumberjack's Rage gets wasted but the Guard's Shield for some reason doesn't. Fisherman, like the Guard, doesn't get wasted but the Bowler still does. Prince and Magic Archer's invisibility would not work as intended and the Royal Ghost will not go invisible with it. Now if you get unstoppable on P.E.K.K.A, she becomes immune to the Ice Block itself which is I think understandable. And finally we have the energy based clash abilities like the Electro Wizard or the Musketeer and both abilities disappeared like Clash Quest did from the Play Store. But the Witch for some reason passes the vibe check and still gets her energy. All in all I feel like this is a very niche upgrade and extremely situational but it's still very good against Clash abilities. Subscribe if the video was cool. See what I did there? Cool? Ice Wizard? Okay I'll see myself out.